Tens of thousands of people flock to Changchao today to celebrate the annual Bun Festival. And in less than 15 minutes, competitors will scramble up the famous Bun Towers for the annual competition. Xiao De Silva is standing by at Changchao to tell us more. Xiao, how's it going out there? Good evening. Despite the rain, it's been a great night here in Changchao. People have just come back from their seafood dinners and from the numerous Cantonese opera shows to watch the exciting bun scrambling competition, which this year is in its 10th anniversary since the tradition was revived in 2005. But between watching the parade and feasting on peace buns, um, there's been plenty of fun here throughout the day. Let's have a look. <laughs> The dragons woke up early on Chengchao today. It's that one day of the year when this normally sleepy island is packed with visitors to celebrate the Bun Festival. This couple is from Australia. Um, a parade. I heard that the little children get dressed up in pretty costumes. Mm, yeah. Carried along. Yeah, and we want to look at the Bun Towers. Okay. These people thought the peace buns are well worth waiting in line for an hour. Customers are spoiled for choice. This woman couldn't decide between lotus bean or sesame paste filling. The piece logo is on every merchandise imaginable. The vendors just hoped the weather wouldn't ruin this once a year business opportunity. Despite the rain, huge crowds of revelers are here in Chengchao Island celebrating this wonderful mixture of religious tradition, food, music and political satire that makes this festival one of Hong Kong's main tourist attractions. And this is the highlight for the day, the parade. The so-called floating children, some of them making a mockery of government officials. This one is supposed to be Chief Secretary for Administration, Carrie Lam. The Chen Chao Ban Festival has its roots in the island's tradition of warding off the plague and bad luck. The people of Chen Chao have been marking the event by praying for peace in the fourth month of the lunar calendar. Everything is set here for the start of the bun scrambling competition. At the stroke of midnight, the 12 contestants will be racing to the top of the 18-meter tower behind me as they snatch buns, which are worth more points the higher they are. So stay tuned, we'll be bringing you all the action live in just a few minutes. That's all from me, back to you in the studio.